Good morning. I am on my way to school. I thought I would film in my car this morning because it is snowing. Look at this. It's snowing and I was not expecting snow. The temperature is 34, but I am almost to school, so I just wanted to show you guys the snow, but I'll catch back up with y'all when I get to school. Look at this. It's starting to lay on the ground. And the temperature is 33. Hmm. So I don't know if I told you guys this or not, but we are going to be a one-to-one -one school next year, hopefully before school starts. But um, it's just gonna be kindergarten first and second grade is gonna be a one-to-one -one with iPads. And so right now we just have a rolling iPad cart that we can check out from the library. And I have two iPads that are mine in my room. Well, they're not mine, but they're mine. And so this morning, I we did our lip block rotations, and for our read to self rotation, we did two of them, so two groups of kids. Um, I checked out the iPad cart from the library, which is this green cart right here. And so I let them go into Epic and find books to read on Epic for their read to self time this morning. So if you're not familiar with Epic, it's actually called getepic.com and you have to create a profile for all of your students and then they can go in and find books to read. There are all kinds of books, fiction, nonfiction, any kind of category. There are audiobooks and read aloud books for kids who, you know, need to listen to the story. And so we got two rotations done. I'm going to keep them one more day and then that way the other two groups that didn't get to use them today can use them tomorrow. And then we had our wise time. Well, actually we did Freedom Summer and my kids are doing a character point of view. And so I did, we did a character, what was it called? Like a character analysis. It wasn't called character analysis, but something like that. And I put them with a partner. And so one of the students had Joe, which is a character in the story, the white boy. And then the other partner had John Henry, who is the black boy in the story. And so they were kind of talking about the way, you know, different character traits and quotes and actions and conflicts and things like that. So it went pretty well. They didn't get finished, so we'll have to carry it over until tomorrow. Actually, not tomorrow. I'm not going to be here tomorrow because I'm actually going to a workshop, which is for the one-to-one -one training. Or it's a one-to-one -one training. <laughs> I can't talk. Um... But then we had our wise group, which is a small, you know, small group reading. And I told my students if they worked really hard at the end, they could get a starburst. Well, I had one little boy decide to take more than he was supposed to. He grabbed three and I caught him and he tried to cover it up with an excuse. So I took all three pieces away and told him he was not getting candy from me because he tried to steal from me. So then I had a big heart to heart with my class about stealing and how when you steal something, you're not, nobody can trust you and there's consequences and stealing something as small as a piece of candy is just as bad as stealing something big. So unfortunately, I can't believe he did that. Actually, I can't believe he did that, but he shouldn't have and hopefully he learned his lesson. My kids are at lunch right now. I am going to go grab a bite of lunch. I brought oatmeal today, so I'm going to have some oatmeal and have a talk with my team. And I don't think we're meeting today because we're not going to be here tomorrow and we're going to use today to kind of, you know, do our sub plans and get things ready. So I will catch back up with you guys then. Well, it is four o'clock and I'm getting ready to head out. This afternoon we had math intervention groups. I don't even think I've filmed since my kids were in lunch. Oh my goodness. During my planning time today, I worked on sub plans because I'm not going to be here tomorrow. So that took the whole time. 
and then we had math. We didn't go outside for playtime today because it was very cold. And then we did our intervention groups this afternoon. I had a conference with a parent at three o'clock and then I had to organize everything for my sub tomorrow. So I'm just now having a chance to film. But I've got all my sub plans laid out here, ready for my sub tomorrow. I've got to grab my computer and take it with me. And then I've started getting my stuff together so I can head out. Um, since I'm not going to be here tomorrow, I have to bring Paisley to school, which is way out of my way. So I'm considering maybe spending the night with my parents tonight. I don't really know because they live like 15 minutes from here and it would be easy for me to swing by, drop her off and then go to my workshop. So I don't know what I'm going to do about that. I really don't know. But my counter's cleaned off. I'm pretty happy about that. It looks nice and clean for my sub. And then in the morning for morning work, this is what my kids are going to do. So they're going to find all the compound words and write them in the pot of gold. And then on the back, they can write a story using all the compound words. And I circled that with a highlighter because they never see the bonus box for some reason. Paisley's upstairs. I've got to run by the grocery store and then we're going to head on home. So thank you guys so much for watching this video today. I probably won't be filming tomorrow just because I'm not even going to be at school. I'm going to be in a workshop at our county office. So I will see you guys on Friday. Bye.